WBUA meteorologist James Bryant here on this Saturday evening just after the Alabama game and here we are it's muggy it's warm again but another change is on the way we're gonna see another cold front move through Sunday night provide us with a good soaking uh, one that is needed and then once again it is going to feel fall like this week it's going to be about where we should be so it's been very warm for most of October this week's gonna be about where we should be just just below normal for a couple days uh, so let's run you through some graphics radar right now Saturday evening shows nothing on Alabama's radar, but if you look just to the west, there's a batch of showers and storms over Louisiana, Mississippi, and Arkansas. There's some severe weather ongoing over central Oklahoma with the main cold front. These areas of showers and storms are what's going to bring us our rainfall Sunday afternoon, evening, and early Monday morning for uh, Tuscaloosa and other parts of Alabama. Uh, the dew points right now are making the temperatures feel a little bit warmer. Uh, 65 degree dew point in Tuscaloosa. There's a muggy feel to the air out there. Um, it's very, very uh, humid for this time of year for sure. But what you would expect being in front of a uh, storm system uh, that is on the way. And so the air mass will change with that front um, by Monday morning. So here's the future cast as we look through the next couple days. By Sunday afternoon... Four, five, six o'clock, our first round of showers and storms looks to be approaching from the west. This could be heavy at times, and really, I don't expect severe weather to be much of a threat. Maybe an isolated damaging wind gust. I really don't see severe weather being a huge threat. This line's going to weaken, and then more rain is going to filter into most of the state of Alabama. Going to be a very good soaking from Sunday afternoon all the way through Monday morning, and then areas west of Tuscaloosa start to clear out by Monday morning. By Monday afternoon, we're just dealing with a few clouds and a few showers, and by Monday night, we start to clear out. Now, the rain, total rainfall amounts, most of this is going to fall Sunday night uh, into early Monday, uh, but we could see two, maybe even three inches of rain in some spots, especially in the northern half of the state. So what does that give us? Well, that gives us a very fall-like pattern setting up Tuesday through Saturday, temperatures in the 60s and 70s, very cold mornings. Very warm afternoons, but where we should be for this time of year, we just have to get through the storm system that comes through Sunday night into early Monday. Once again, I think a lot of areas are going to clear out uh, by the afternoon on Monday. It won't be an entire day rain thing. We might even see some sun uh, towards sunset, but it is clouds and a couple showers will stick around on Monday. But it looks to be a very nice week once you get past that, especially if you love the fall weather. I'm James Wright for WUA 23.